Another typhoon approaching Korea, the 18th typhoon of the season, Mitag, is forecast to hit the southern parts of the country on Thursday, which is National Foundation Day. Some parts of the country can expect heavy rain from Tuesday as the typhoon approaches. Che Jung Yoon has the latest. Typhoon Mitag is likely to strike the South Korean mainland by early Thursday. According to the Korean Meteorological Administration on Monday morning, Typhoon Mitak was located some 400 kilometers off the coast of Taiwan, traveling in a west-northwest direction toward Shanghai, China. It is a medium-sized typhoon with a maximum wind speed of 115 kilometers per hour, but is expected to weaken as it passes by China on Tuesday night. Under its projected direction, the typhoon will reach the seas west of Jeju-do Island on Wednesday, and travel north to waters of Cheollanamdo province by the next morning. Jeju-do Island is expected to feel the effects of the typhoon starting from Tuesday, with heavy downpours from 30 to 80 millimeters of rain and even up to 600 millimeters in mountainous regions. The typhoon will leave the Korean peninsula on Friday, moving into the East Sea near Dokdo Island. But there is a possibility of the typhoon changing direction westward which may have a bigger influence on metropolitan areas in the central parts of the country. Jeju Island has been struck four times by typhoons this season, and Mitak will be the fifth following the typhoons Tanas, Lekima, Lingling and Tapa. Typhoon Mitak will also be the season's seventh typhoon to have an impact on the Korean peninsula, which means this year will have had more typhoons than any other year since 1959. Choi Jung-yoon, Arirang News.